Okay. Um, DJ Academics said that he believes Big E was bi. Um, I know we've kind of touched on lyrics and stuff he said, but what do you? I wanted to get your thoughts and if you agreed or disagreed or what your thoughts were when it came to Big E as opposed to Diddy. Yeah. The things that I saw about, about Big E, we know he talked about in his lyrics about doing stuff to young kids. I always looked at, at Big E as one of those young men that was caught in the 90s that liked young girls, uh, which was quite frankly, uh, it was quite frequent in the 90s where guys that was like 24, 23, 22, love, for some reason they love those, those little 16, 17 year old young ladies. And uh, as we seen with that young girl that was sitting on his lap that was only 14 years old while he's smoking a marijuana joint. Um, I know we done posted that picture several times on Bomb First of him doing that. Um, his lyrics, he has a lot of lyrics. Uh, I know the main one where he's saying, sucking your daddy dick and doing something like that. And if you listen to a lot of his lyrics, they were kind of uh, explicit. And um, so I think academics, y'all know I like academics a lot. I listen, he's one of the channels that I listen to a lot. And you know, he's very, uh, he works that computer. Like I would, would want to work that computer and to be able to work, uh, you know, uh, stuff. And, and break stuff down. Great researcher in my mind, in my opinion. Him and, him and Art does a great job of researching uh, topics. Um, so if academics are saying that, I think he's getting that from his lyrics. Because like John, John, you know, John can tell you what every Tupac lyric is. He, me and him don't talk about too many other artists other than Tupac, and then he's a Drake head. Um, other than those two, I don't hear John talking about too many other people's lyrics. But those two he talks about a lot. So I'm thinking academics is maybe has been researching and uh, listening to a lot of lyrics that, uh, that Biggie has said. I always got the lyrics from Biggie as being a, uh, a uh, person that like underage girls. But apparently I think that's what academic is going with as far as some lyrics that Biggie has stated that would make him talk like he was bisexual. Uh, that would be my only, uh, that would be the only thing that I could see or, or, or have observed of Biggie being bisexual. Now I know a lot of people say, well, because he kept having that, that guy that everybody knew was a male uh, in his video and being Lee Rose and stuff like that well, might be why they want to call him bisexual. Um, but I don't know if he really knew. I blame stuff like that on the uh, directors, the video directors, and the um, the you know the the uh, the people that um, you know that the, the search the talent. Um, I forget what they call them, but um, the people that do the uh, the casting, the, the casting directors and stuff like that. That be getting those people because there's been many of video shoots where I know artists that showed up. And they were there. They very, very rarely have, uh, other than maybe picking the the lead person, they don't be knowing. Or they don't be sitting there picking out the everybody that's going to be in the video. Some that's the dancers, they would do that with the dancers, but I don't remember them really sitting for everybody that's in the video shoot, uh, picking out who's in there, other than usually the lead, the lead person uh, for that particular video shoot. And so, yeah, I would love to see him. Uh, or see, I noticed he posted that on one of his uh, Instagrams or something like that. But I can't wait to see him break that down to explain what he meant by that. Because I'm sure that's why he did it. And I'm sure he's going to be probably talking about it within the coming week or two.